All right, guys, I'm back with part two of my friend mail from Deborah Cabasa. She sent me this whole big box full of different kinds of jewelry. So, take a look at individual pieces. But I did get this out before, and I'm, it is so heavy. Somebody's going to love this. Somebody could take this apart and make a, like five, six probably pieces out of it. It needs to be adjusted to where it is just like multi, multi, multi strand faux pearls. Hang out there for a second. Let's see if I can get a hold of this hold of the right side of it. I'm trying, I'm trying. Oh, I can't do it. But it's just gorgeous. And it's really mixed in with the faux pearls. It's got some clear beads. And these are just really nice. It's not wanting to focus for me. No, I don't, I don't know. They might be. Really nice, really, really nice. This and this and this and some little things at the bottom. Let's get it all out. Let's see what's in these. This is a nice, nice long, oh, it's like that. Nice long um, silver chain, silver tone chain with a lobster claw clasp and then at the end it's got these plastic thrown over your neck awesome awesome and then we have another long necklace wrapped up in some bubble wrap you just throw over your clear um, beads in it they're plastic very nice really long probably 30 38 inches maybe Need some more necklaces because oh this has got a tag on it oh this is this is one necklace I thought it was two this is interesting hold on a second guys let me get it my hand right Lydell or Lydell 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 and it's not one to focus because it's got all that stuff behind it I made in China it's got the hang tag on it. Okay. Focus in on the tag. Focus in on the tag. I'm going to be doing some heavy duty and editing. A made in China on that set brand. Really interesting, like a gunmetal color on that part. The chain is double. And then these big. Okay, let's see what's in this. Ooh, ooh, silver. I know you guys love, you guys like silver. Lobster class. It is tangled, but you can get the idea of what it is. With those silver um, beads on it. This looks like some red, white, and blue jewelry. Do I like these? Is that what it's called? I never, I know what it's called, F-A-C-E-T-E-D, but it, how do you pronounce it? Oh, cool. I like these to where they shine. These are plastic, but they're nice. They're those kind that go like this. See that it's not zooming in right. Or focusing right. It probably says Hong Kong on the thing or Japan. Oh no, it says Germany! Even more awesomer! Germany but they're not glad see the ends on them they're in really good shape awesome somebody will love those I'm trying to get this gold one untangled from this because it looks really neat okay what's this all I know is it has this on there and that just it's, that color just is awesome looking it's on like a snake chain like that I guess that's what you call it Reminds you of a warmer snake. You won't see me untangling. That's always my cue when I say editing on this when I hit the button to edit. Oh, it's double stranded. Okay, I get it. Yeah, that was pretty easy. Look at that. That is simple, but it is gorgeous with that mint and then it's got an extender on it. It's gold tone. Oh yeah, I like that. Excellent shape. Thank you so much, Deborah. You sent me so 
such nice things. I appreciate it so much. Sell those as a set. Whoops, sorry. You're like drop. You're falling over. Sorry. Here. Focus in on the leaf. Tell me what you think about it. My stuff back here. I'm gonna pause you for. Ooh, I found what I was looking for. For Fourth of July. Look, they match this necklace. This necklace is plastic, but gotta love plastic. Ooh, it's got a nice clasp on it. I think it might be. Hong Kong. Aren't these neat? I think these are neat. Let me back you up. See? This. Nice 4th of July. Yep, I'll sell those together. Okay, let's see what else we got. All 925. I'm not sure if it is. Or if that's just a bag she put it in. This is a little brooch. Isn't that pretty? All that confetti stuff inside there. And then there's some, there's, or maybe 925, I don't know. Oh, well, let's see if it's 925. Because there's a little thing right here that we can check it out. If my thing will focus, it won't focus. Okay. While I look and see if this is marked. You didn't have to do this. I don't know if I can get to zoom in. It's so fuzzy. Why is it so fuzzy? It's Italy 925. So it is, it is, this bag is stuff. It is 925. She sent me 925. I saved that. So I'm assuming all the items in this bag were 925. Let's see if this one is marked. Italy 925. Oh, Deborah, that's so sweet of you. And this has got a tag on it. What's it say? Italy 925 and it's marked D Y A D M A. Oh, Deborah, you're so sweet. So I'm assuming that this little earring is probably. Ah, 14 carat. Spain. 14 carat what? Was that NP or JP or what is it? That's JV. Right here, what's that say? JV Spain, 14 karat. 14 karat gold, I'm assuming? There's only one of those. I'm not complaining, I'm speedy. She had it in the bag mark 925. Is, am I missing a 925 mark on here? I'm gonna put those back in that bag. That That's so nice of you, Deborah. Thank you so much. Oh, you Canadians tell me. Is that a maple leaf? Then we have some stuff wrapped up in tissue paper. Heart necklace. And it says, love you, Abby. So if anybody knows somebody named Abby, and you, need to, you, want, you love them and you want to give them a necklace, I have one for you. Full rhinestone blinged out heart pendant. That's pretty. Well, guys, this was just awesome that Deborah sent me all this. I have another friend mail package I'm going to make a video. And thank you so much for sending me 925 silver. This is, you didn't have to do that. Um, so, like I said, I'll put Deborah's link to her. And please go over and subscribe to her and help her out and watch some of her stuff. And you'll see her in some in my auctions as she comes to other people's auctions, too. So, thanks for joining me. This one ran a little past 10 minutes, but I know I will. Um, edit it down to 10. So thank you guys for watching and